Nice. Spawn, and you will wait for Korga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Ragrashev, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <gasps> Magrin, give her a chance. You, get back! Keep back! Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You! Apparently Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. Girl? You mean parasite. She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it, the Tree Father's spirit in your words. It is as you say. Sivisif, Tila, to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. It hurts. Thank you, Koga. Master Halsin... Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? First you urge grace, then you speak truth. You surprised me twice over. A shame the grace period ends. The Viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the writers resumed. Free of intruders. And mine perish if he stays. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Sevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. You will do more than speak. I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's 
Just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. More venom in our heart than a snake in its fangs. But at least the child is safe. What is youth if not a time to be forgiven for one's transgressions? Couldn't agree more. The girl wasn't innocent, but that doesn't mean she was guilty. I see you. Just give me a moment. This medicatrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? You found her, but I still don't know what she can do for you. Why are you asking? A tadpole. A mind flare tadpole. I... Uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. This way. This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Seems so. Gave Master Halson a right start. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. A pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. Let's see what we can do. Of course. Now, tell me what's been happening. Any symptoms? Strange events? Victims can identify each other. Not that the others know they're victims, of course. How do you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. Look, you've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. The thorn? Coated in a fatal toxin. It was a last resort, in case only a way out. I'm sorry for misleading you, but I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. Now, do I have your word or not? I hope it doesn't come to that, but thank you. Here. You know, I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. You can't cure what you don't understand. And as much as I know about mind flayers, I can't make heads nor tails of this. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Could be, but there's a lot we don't know.